Y'all ain't gonna believe this one. A giant spotted in Thailand. Just a few days ago on the 5th of December, TikToker Bao Udana posted this video. And for some reason, it hasn't gone viral at all. But I believe it's no doubt authentic. His page literally tells the story. He only has 2,800 followers. Probably most of them came from that video. And if you go through his feed, he simply posts his everyday life at home and once in a while, he posts himself with filters. That's it. So as far as the validity and authenticity of the video, I believe it's 100% real. And when you watch it for yourself, listen to them in the background, their amazement, it seems absolutely genuine. But y'all know the drill. Before we continue this video, fam, do me a solid. Like, comment, subscribe, follow, and share the video. When you engage with it, it really helps push it to the next level, gets me more views. I'm really looking to increase that subscriber count. Been stalemating a little bit on YouTube, and I would really like to see those numbers go up. So if you guys could do that for me, it would be awesome. Thank you. So when you watch this video, pay close attention. At first, the being doesn't move very much at all. But then you'll see it move its arm and then kind of slightly hunch over. And after that, it does something that I can't quite tell what it is. It almost reminds me of, I don't even want to say it, a shapeshifter. But enough babbling, check it out, folks. Here, I've went ahead and zoomed in for you and stabilize the image so that you can get a better look at it. In the next one, I'll zoom in even further. But this is some really good... Up Gotta be 15 feet tall, 20. You can see its movements. Punches over its stature and literally crawls away. Go, it lifted its hands up. Almost as if it's praying. As if it's thanking a god. And then, I don't know what it does right there, fam. It's wild. All right, y'all, in this video, I zoomed it in as far as I could. You can see, it almost looks like he's kneeling down, y'all. He's on his knees. You can see he has a belly. You can see his long arms. His hair is dark. You can see him moving his hands. Almost as if he's praying. Then he kneels over. If he is on his knees, this being has got to be 30 feet tall all day long. Insane, fam. Insane. What makes the sighting even more fascinating is that Thailand is actually rich with giant legend and folklore. And if you've done any research at all on giants in this planet, you've seen this picture. The picture of a 6.5 meter tall giant that has a massive snake wrapped around it and it looks as though they were fighting to the death. Now, according to Snopes, fact checker, this was just an art exhibit, but I did a little more digging and actually found a news report based in Thailand where a woman says that they found this in the Krabi province. And based on the news report, they act like it was dug up by archeologists and it was a legit excavation, that it's not fake, but Take it for what you will. And legend has it that in this region, there was a Krabi giant and a Naga, which is a giant snake. And both of them fell in love with Princess Frenang, the goddess of the sea. As a result, they fought each other to the death, but both of them losing their lives. It's said that they ended up being the mountains that flank the Krabi River, which is almost exactly where this was found. This discovery, along with the discovery of other larger animal bones, was found in the Kaukam Cave. 
And if you ever go to Thailand, you can actually visit this and see it to this day. It is a tourist attraction. Again, from what I've read and studied from news articles from Thailand and news reports, that it's actually authentic. It's a real giant. Now, I'm not saying that for sure. They could just be doing that to bring tourism, but you never know. Then you have the Sahas Desha and the Ravana in Wat Arun, which is the Temple of the Dawn in Bangkok. The giants and the Ravana are based on characters from the Ramakayan. Forgive me if I murdered that. They are depicted standing guard at the temple, symbolizing the protection of the sacred site. The legend of the Tatayan or Titan neighborhood where the Temple of the Sun is located further embellishes the roles, incorporating local folklore and Buddhist teachings. They look very intimidating. They have fangs and they have masks, but they are gentle giants. That's one thing about Thai folklore. They want you to not judge a book by its cover. And those are just a couple of the legends of giants in Thailand. They go way back, millions of years. Now that you've seen that, I noticed that it looks like this being has a belly, he's thick, and in other portions, you can almost see a little like ponytail coming off his head, right? A while back, probably a year ago, a follower sent me some coordinates to a being in South America. And that being completely reminds me of this giant. All right, y'all, check it out. It's at damn near the southernmost tip of South America, which is crazy because on the Monte Urbano map, it's called the Land of the Giants. This being reminds me a lot of the being in Thailand. You can see he's very dark, like the Moors. Probably Tartarian descendant, but he's got a slight ponytail, maybe dressed up in tribal. You can see his belly. And this guy looks to be 42 feet tall. Now, it is Google Earth, I understand that. You can take it with a grain of salt if you want. But once you zoom in, you can see he's almost looking up at the sky, at the sun. Has tribal on, crazy stuff. So again, this is some of the most legit footage I've ever seen of a giant caught on film. Yes, it is just a shadow, you don't get to see it in detail, but you get the idea. This thing is huge. If you look comparably to the trees around it, it's a massive being. And it's moving. It's legit. Wild, y'all. One of the craziest videos I've ever seen of giants. You can see right here his head, his belly. He's on his knees. And he's still 10 to 15 feet tall. He's got to be a 20 plus foot tall being. Wild, fam. Wild. But of course, you know, this is for entertainment purposes only. May or may not be true. Could be total CGI. You never know. But I hope you enjoyed this video. Next, I am going to do Leave the World Behind. So stay tuned for that. Stay in the love, stay in the light, be kind to others. I am out.